John Gosling, The Kinks keyboardist, dead at 75. British rock band The Kinks are known for influencing American artists with hits including Lola and Come Dancing. John Gosling, a keyboardist for The Kinks, died on Friday. He was 75. Members of the legendary British rock group paid tribute to the piano player on social media following his death. We are deeply saddened by the news of the passing of John Gosling. We are sending our condolences to John's wife and family, the band wrote alongside a black and white video of Gosling. Ray Davies, a founding member of the group, shared condolences to his wife Teresa and family. Rest in peace dearest John. Lead guitarist Dave Davies wrote, I'm dismayed deeply upset by John Gosling's passing. He has been a friend and important contributor to the Kinks music during his time with us. Deepest sympathies to his wife and family. I will hold deep affection and love for him in my heart always. Great musician and a great man. Mick Avora, the band's longtime drummer, shared online, Today we lost a dear friend and colleague, he was a great musician and had a fantastic sense of humor. Which made him popular member of the band, he leaves us with some happy memories. God bless him. Gosling was classically trained as an organist and a pianist. He joined the band in 1970, and his audition was the recording session for, Lola. He performed on 10 albums throughout 8 years with the influential rock group, including, Muswell Hillbillies, and, Everybody's in Showbiz. Gosling left the Kinks in 1978 and later became a founding member of the cast off Kinks in 1994. Gosling, who was known as John the Baptist, performed with Avora, Jim Rodford, and John Dalton until his retirement in 2008. In an interview shared on Cast Off Kinks, Gosling was asked how he thought his life would develop had he not joined the Kinks in the 70s. Gosling responded, no idea but music would have always occupied a major part of it I'm sure. Or I might have just become a unicorn exterminator. 